Good morning, everyone, and welcome to my channel, Keto Homestead with Jess. It's a beautiful morning here in Ohio, at least for me it is. It's kind of overcast, but woke up in a good mood. I usually do wake up in a good mood, but it's a good day. I'm happy to be alive another day, playing around. Um, it's 6 o'clock in the morning here, and listening to my music, and singing along, and Figured I'd share that with you, but I am not a professional singer, so <laughs> bear with me as I sing this song with you guys. Um, I just felt like waking up and praising God and just in a good mood this morning. So anyways, I wanted to talk to you guys today in the morning chat. I've gotten and asked um, a few questions uh, regarding the taco soup, and I wanted to cover that. So... With that being said, I just want to let you know that I am rebellious. I am my mother and father's child. I do can various things, and one of the questions that came up was in my video was that cream cheese that I can. And yes, it was cream cheese that I can. And in the video, I stated that it is not FDA approved to can milk products, and cream cheese falls in that category. However, when I decide to do something, I'm not just rebellious and go out and do it. A lot of research and um, look into everything and I weigh the pros and cons and I'm just really thorough about my research before I do anything. Just know that. If you're wanting to can cream cheese, that is totally up to you, but I would recommend you do your research and you make that judgment call yourself. Another thing was my canning lids. Now, I personally do reuse my canning lids. That is also not recommended by the FDA. However, um, my mother-in-law can for 50 years. I don't know how long she can. She's now passed, but um, she grew up in the depression and through my research and knowing for a fact that our grandparents, great-grandparents, or parents did not throw anything away in the Depression. So it's hard for me to imagine that the farmers and the homesteaders back during the Depression went out and bought canning lids every time they needed them. I just don't see the possibility in that economic um, time for them to do that. So on my own judgment call, I do reuse my canning lids. Now, also in my videos, you see that I put hot, hot boiling water over my canning lids. I, rent, I wash my canning lids and then I also do the boiling because they're safe. That's another judgment call that you need to make. A lot of canners will tell you do not use your canning reuse your canning lids however I find that if they're clean they're sanitized and they are dent free then they will continue to seal and I will continue to use them so that's just my little tidbit for this morning I hope you all are having a wonderful morning and I will see you later thank you for joining me with a chat with Jess and I look forward to talking to you soon. Please subscribe, like, and comment below and let me know your thoughts. Singing, oh Lord, keep me in the moment. Help me live with my eyes wide open. Cause I don't want to miss what you have for me. Singing, oh Lord, show me what matters. Throw away what I'm chasing after. Cause I don't want to miss what you have for me. Keep me in the moment. Oh, keep me in the moment. Keep me in the moment. Cause I don't want to miss what you have for me.